Hello everyone! Today I'll be doing a solo flawless on the Legend Lost Sector Scavenger's Den with Titan. Today you can actually farm the exotic leg armor for your Titan, Warlock, or Hunter. For my subclass, I'll be using Middle Tree, Code of the Devastator. For my Kinetic, I'll be using Long Shadow. For my energy weapon, I'll be using the 7 Seraph VY-7. For my heavy, I'll be using Xenophage. For my helmet, I'll be using Double Machine Gun Ammo Finder, 10 Discipline Mod with Hammer of the Warmine. Next, I'll be using Oblu Submachine Gun, Fire Recovery, Submachine Gun Gun Loader, and Burning Cells. For my exotic, I'll be using Armamentarium with Discipline Mod plus 10, Arc Damage Resistance, Machine Gun Reserves with Global Reach. Next I'll be using Double Machine Gun Scavenger with 5 Discipline and War Mines Protection. Last I'll be using Double Bomber with Wrath of Rasputin, 10 Discipline Mod. Alright guys, so there's gonna be two champions, one barrier, an overload champion will appear very soon once you clear down the amount of ads. There's gonna be a couple snipers from left and right. I always take them down before doing DPS at the anti barrier champion because they will kill you when you're trying to kill this servitor right here. I decided to spam the xenophage as quickly as I can. That way he won't or she, he, she won't pop a barrier shield. Once I do that, I throw on my nade, clear down a couple of ads so the overload can spawn on the top left side. So there'll be a couple of shanks, you can easily just use a submachine gun and to do DPS at the Xenophage. I have done a test run on the Sundering Blast. There is a bug with this specific submachine gun where it just moves and keeps shooting even though you stagger it. I will do more testing, more testing runs with different weapons because so far it's bugged for this specific weapon. In this area, there's going to be one overload champion from the top left, I mean the right. Always clear down all the adds and the adds where they can shoot solar. As I mentioned before, there is 50% damage they can do damage. Also, you could do 50% damage with any solar weapons or, of course, solar subclass. Which is why I'm in the middle tree solar class for a Titan. So you can easily clear them down and proceed to the next area. Another thing I'd like to mention is where my cells can actually destroy the lasers. So you will see here that. I destroy the lasers with the wormite cell. So in this room, there's going to be two champions, one overload and one barrier champion. This part's a bit RNG to be honest. So the overload champion can appear in front of you where I'm standing right now, or it can be a coward and just not be there where for plan B you will have to pull back as you can see here plan A didn't work out. If the overload champion's not pushing you then plan B would be to take down the barrier champion from far distance but be aware of the couple of adds where they can throw arc nades at you when you're trying to do DPS at the barrier champion. Once I take down the barrier champion I decide to take down a couple of adds far away with the sniper. Once I do clear down a couple of adds, I will take down the overload champion once he is staggered. So you can see here I'm just spamming my submachine gun, waiting for him to be staggered. That way I can kill him very quickly. Once I clear down a couple of ads, I'll be using my super. You can see that the middle tree titan's actually useful for once. So you can just spam your super to do DPS at the boss. 
Unfortunately, he was running away from me. As always, every time I'm Titan, he always runs away. He did this. This happened to me pre-stage, nightfalls, and now lost sectors. You can also do the finisher when he is on critical health. And there you go, guys. We finally beat the lost sector. And hopefully you can get the exotic leg for the titan. And you can see here, I got it. I was very happy. Thank you so much for watching, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.